Oh, honey Krishna, <laughs> one day he was playing on Brahmand Ghat <laughs> with uh, all his funny friends. But today there was any other kind of a ranga. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> All were happy except Krishna. All, all were doing like and laughing so much. And sing towards Krishna. And all were laughing. Krishna cannot, could not understand anything. But there Prabhu was also clapping and so much uh, laughing and clapping. Krishna could not think that what is the matter today. <coughs> Bill Mangal told, my dear friend, do you know why all are clapping? Oh, I cannot understand, I cannot think why they are clapping. He told in his very, very, eh? in the ear of Krishna, you are not son of Jasuda Maya. This is the fact. How? Because you are black, your mother is golden color, your father is also golden color. <laughs> How? From where you came? Black, so black. This is, oh, I'm black. <laughs> he could not reply them that five years black, black. But his mother and father both are so golden color, so beautiful. And they began more to clap and to do like this. Krishna, <laughs> Krishna began to weep. Do I am not, I'm not the son of my mother Yasoda. And he began to weep. And all were clapping and all that to say Rijharayate. Making fun of him. Making fun of him. Krishna <laughs> began to be, and he ran, ran towards his home to Mother Jasoda. Jasoda was doing something, preparing anything for Krishna and Balde. Roni Maya was also there. All were engaged in that. But Krishna was today so weeping, and began to roll down on earth. Yasoda Miya at once came and he wanted to pacify Krishna. Why? What became of you? Who has beaten you? And he's too caustic. I will beat them. I will punish them. Oh, Baldev has done? He is not telling us. Who has done? Sridham has done? Oh, they are so wicked, I know. <laughs> Why you go to with, that, with them and play? What has been done, tell me. And he began to take Krishna in his lap, heart lap. But he was doing like... <laughs> and he was sliding, sliding. And he could not pacify, he began to weep more and more. After some time. He was, she was thinking, yeah, why she is she? Anyhow, she took Krishna in his lap, possibly and told them, tell in my ear, what has, who has done this? Your father has done, chastised you, or who has chastised you? He told, oh, all are clapping and laughing that you are not your son, Jasoda no. Maya. Anyhow, your mother was black, your father was black. No, no. They were black. And from them you came. And, but perhaps they could not support you and they had no milk in them. <laughs> that is why they kept it in a tree. And there you are, were weeping, sometimes talking your dish and, and weeping bitterly. No one was to take care. Nand Baba is so merciful. He came to Brahmandra to take bath and he saw that, oh, any orphan boy. 
and he is weeping there, so he become merciful, and he took at once in his lap and returned to home and gave in the lap of the Sudha. He is, has no mother and father, so you should support this boy like you. So they are telling that you are not son of Jasoda, Maya and Nanda Baba. <coughs> then I am going anywhere else to search my father and mother. Or I will go in Brahmand Ghat and jump. Or I will go to any dense forest, anywhere. I don't be, want to be here. Jasoda, who told? So all are telling. Gaubhaya is also telling. Yes, he is also telling. Oh. I am telling you, taking the oath of my deity Narayan, that you are my son. You are so my son. I have taken you in my own, and whole Brajabhashi are witness. witness. All know this fact. So you can go to any mother of any boy, your friend, and they will tell you. So I am taking you. This oath that you are my son, you are my son, you are my son. You don't sit like that. One day he became more, more, more. And then he was telling that, Mother, I want to graze cows. This is a fashion or this is a rule and regulation in Indian goats. Milkmen, that their sons should be also in a very good auspicious day and they should go to So now Krishna and Baldev with all boys, five years, six years, seven years, eight, eight years, they used to graze cows very near to Gokul, very near, not going here and there. So, they were grazing. One day Jasoda, Krishna had a habit. He was taking, stealing butter. And Jasoda told, Oh, why you don't tell me abundant of all these things? Why you go to other homes and steal butter like this? You should not do it. Mother, when I have stolen, in very morning, you send me to cow grazing, not cow, cough grazing. I go to Madhuban. And whole day with them there grazing. And evening I return. So when I stay, I have no time. And coming from that, at once taking anything and sleep. And again going there. Yashoda is telling that Tainehi Makhan Khayo. Yeah, Makhan Khayo. Ah, Krishna is telling Maya, Mainehi Makhan Khayo. Bhora Phayo Madhu. Maya, mother, I have not taken more. I have not stolen. When I have done. Bhur bhayo gauman ki paache madhuban mohi pathayo. I went to graze cows in very morning. And whole day then do. I tired and then I returned and at once I began to sleep. But Jasoda Maya told, oh yes, you have stolen, I know. <laughs> then Krishna told, to be It seems that, mother, you are not my mother. You are my step brother, perhaps, mother. <laughs> so while I am here, then I am going to anywhere else. I am telling that Krishna weeping and began to run away from the home. <coughs> Jasoda Maya. At once, turned, and he began to weep. But my dear son, you are my son. 
Never tell like this, uh, otherwise I will die. I know that you have not taken Markham. <laughs> My son, you have not taken Markham. And Krishna is then weeping, telling, Maya, maine hi maakhan khayo. Maine hi maakhan khayo means? I did. Certainly. And Jasoda Maya is telling me. No, 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 no. <laughs> and then Jasoda Maya picked up Krishna and began to read. Krishna was also like him. So, uh, all this is like a. Um, kya? Last time. Renewal of love. Renewal of love. Renewal of love. Once that perhaps this is the case that Krishna goes to other houses, never our houses, to take Makkhan because they are sweet. And in my house, I have kept so many servants, maid servants. They make curd and they churn and perhaps the makhan is so sour, not so sweet. So from today, I will tell all the my servants and maid servants, all my sakhi, they should go to resident to the Pavali, to arrange for the Pavali. You know the Pavali? To go back and lax and lax Pradesh or lamb. And in your home, everywhere Pradesh, with ghee, not candle. Ghee Pradesh is so much gainful, so pure. And it refreshes the air and everything. So, all went. And Jasoda Maya milked Padma Gandha. Padma Gandha Goma means whose milk was. Like Padma Gandha, lotus flowers, fragrant. Kalindi, Yamuna, Ishangi, so sweet. Oh. Eight cows were special, like eight Sakhi, eight Manjaris, also eight special cows were in Nandva. They had been taken special care for them. So, Jasoda Maya, today in evening, and made very beautiful uh, curd and the upper malai cream, cream. cream was like so thick, so thick. and reddish color. He was tuck buck, tuck buck doing everything. Tuck buck, you know, everywhere. Drops of ghee are seen like a pearl. pearls here. Just for the mind, very morning at about four. In what time? Brahma Mohurta. And she sat to chat. There was a big rope. In the end of the rope, two sides were some wooden to catch hold. And in a very big um, round pillar, she wrapped two, three times, and she was doing like this. Just so the Maya, very beautiful, otherwise Krishna cannot be so beautiful. Just so the Maya was more beautiful. She, her breast was so, and this very beautiful. Wearing a very uh, fine means uh, reshami, reshmi, you know, that can come in this nail hole. Ten yards, shadi, may come here. How fine. India was famous for this, especially in Dhaka. So, she was bearing. And his beauty, oh, so sweet beauty was Bathing from that. <laughs> and wearing some. And earring here golden. And here golden. When hand he was doing so. Govinda Dhamo Dharma Deji Govinda Dhamo
words like pearls from mouth here and there coming up. The flowers from his baby were one by one coming. And the ankle, wrinkles, like karta, very sweet karta, not like so. Jump a karta, no, no, no. Like tinkling. And when he was short, she was churning, the mathani with curl, the sound was like dhik tam, dhik tam, dhik tam. Those who are not serving Krishna, worshipping Krishna, chanting Krishna, fight to them, fight to them. Dhik tam, dhik, dhik, dhik. And she was of blood totally. Forget everything. Observing him, thinking the pastimes of boy Krishna. I am going on doing. Krishna was sleeping on the bed. And now he was so hungry. Quite naked. But he, at that time, also in sleeping, a very little bansi, always he came. Never. Perhaps he brought from his mother um or I don't know. <laughs> he was like that. Ne? So, with bansi in one hand and weeping, mother, 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 and sometimes like this, mother here, mother here, searching for. But mother was not. Anyhow, he opened his eyes and said, Oh, very far away my mother is Chakma. Now he wanted to go to his mother. The, their weapons is what? Oh, only to cry and to be loud. More loudly, more loudly, louder, louder, loudest. <laughs> so she was weeping, but Jasodha Maya, not hearing. Govinda Dhamma 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 Govinda Dhamma 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 And Faisal was doing Gharra 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 Of Krishna, totally of Krishna, oh my mother is not here. So began to more louder, louder. But Yasodha Maya not yet, but totally observed. What is this? Jatra Madh Bhaktra Gayanti Tat Tishthami Narad. Nam Tishthami Vaikuntha. I am not in Vaikuntha. Yoginam Hrde. Not in the hearts of Yoginam. Where? Where Madh Bhaktra Gayanti? Where they sing? And then at once I used to go there. I cannot live in Vaikuntha anywhere. So quickly Krishna leaving this palanka there and he is running towards Maya. He wanted to go. But how he should? From that palanka plank was so high. So how to come? He can jump whole world. He can fly with Trinavarta here and there. But he cannot get up from his bed. So anyhow, weeping. How, how weeping? Like this. Like, like here. Rubbing his eyes. Rubbing his eyes. Krishna himself so black. And this black water from Kajal also coming out. And he doing so all Kajal. So it became more black. Wow, <laughs> beautiful. Anything, Krishna is even naked, he's so And if a bla black spot, a spot is here, oh, more beautiful. If he is covered with dust, dust of Goraja, cow's, cow's face, oh, it is like a very beautiful powder, powder. And if anyone has met up Krishna, so beautiful. Anything. 
given to Krishna, it makes all the <coughs> He's so beautiful. So, Kajal was there, he was covered with Kajal, but yet he was so beautiful. And then he get down from the court. And he quickly, anyhow, on this, come down. And then he was going. And more and more loudly, louder, louder, louder he was doing. At last he went to very nearer to her mother and stood up and to by his one and he are Jashoda Maya. And other hand on that churning is stick. What happened? At once he stopped his singing. And he saw that. He saw that oh beautiful life. Lala. Mera Lala hai. Meri Mera Lala. Or ye kaisho ki Krishna ko kutti. He took Krishna in her life. And covered Krishna and gave his heart breast. And Krishna was choosing her shakti. And so much, so much milk in her breast that Thir Samudra Koti Koti lacks and lacks. Thir Samudra can come from that. So much. And Krishna, the stomach, how much? Koti Koti Viraja. Virja, you know, can be here. Whole world can be here. So there was a competition. Milk was not stopping. And his hunger and his pet was limitless. No, no, not. So, it was going on. What will be there? We will explain. I think that I should also tell all this kata beautiful in morning also class. Because it will be very benefit for you. Uh, and in my classes in morning, I told the teachings of Ravnath Das Goswami. Very, very good. You should try to obey all these things and to follow. If you want bhakti, and if you don't want bhakti, you want to play and to uh, test anything, worldly desire, then I am not requesting. But I will request you that if you want bhakti, then try to follow very purely and boldly and strongly what Ravnath Das said. But these pastimes have so many teachings also, so many philosophy of bhakti, so much deep philosophy of bhakti. And I will try to explain them. Go, Prima. So you should quickly arrange and once you do it. Tira, you requested that I sing to you in English as your Gurudev also used to uh, sing to you in English. So I wrote this song for you. Deepest, most fathomless ocean of love I dive into your water. My heart opens up like a lotus in the sweetness of you. And then you blow away, you blow away my fears. Yeah, you blow away, you blow away my fears. Deepest, most fathomless ocean of love I dive into. Your 
in the sweetness of your voice. You are my heart and soul. You are the only one I know. For oh, you bring me joy.
Shri Krishna Dina Katune Sulakshan Mahata Shri Dina Lord Chaitanya came to immerse the entire world in pure love for Radha and Krishna. He came to establish the Sankirtan movement and to taste the sweet, loving moods of Srimati Radharani for Krishna. began to criticize him. The Lord, being immersed in Vraj Bhava, saw them as gopis from an opposing camp and chased them away with a stick. Disturbed by Mahaprabhu's behavior, they got together and decided to beat him. To prevent this offensive behavior, Mahaprabhu decided to take sannyas. All the Lord's intimate associates met him in the home of Srivas Pandit. Their hearts filled with pain. They discussed how to keep Garanga from leaving them and taking sannyas. Our Lord Vishwambar will soon leave Nadia to take sannyas. What will we do? As long as he is with us, just relish his beauty with your eyes and listen attentively to his nectarian words. Very soon he will leave his wife, his home, his mother, and all of his servants. Oh, what will happen to you? Oh, Lord Vishwambar, the Lord of our hearts, where are you going? Leaving us alone to be devoured by the snake of Kali Yuga. In fear of Kali, we took shelter of only you. Don't be afraid. Oh. To attain Krishna Prem, I must travel to a distant country. But I will come back and give it to all of you. Indeed, <laughs> us most fallen, how can you leave us? We know from the scriptures that you are the savior of the fallen. Therefore, we gave up all our religious duties and surrendered unto you. Oh, Lord. Lord, how can you leave us like this? <laughs> Prabhu, if you leave us, we will all die of broken hearts. Day and night, we know only you. Even 
even in our dreams, we constantly see your moon-like face. Now you will leave us to be swallowed by the tiger of materialism. How can you be felt so cruel? Fearing a separation from me, you've all become miserable. But my heart and senses are burning in separation from Krishna! Please! Bless me that I may attain Krishna praying for within the core of my heart. <laughs> Somehow, Sachi Devi learned about Garanga's plan to leave home and to take sannyas. In great desperation, Mother Sachi tried to persuade the Lord to stay home. <coughs> My dear son, please do not abandon this home. You are the stick which supports the blind man. My husband died, leaving me a widow. <coughs> My eldest son left to take sannyas. Who will support me? <coughs> oh, me, my. If you also leave, I will die a death without actually leaving my body. You are the personification of dharma. If you abandon your mother, what teachings of dharma will you be given to this world? And what about Vishnu Priya? She is so young, and she has just now come here. She doesn't understand the ways of this world. What will happen to her? Anyway, you are the jewel of my eyes. You are the lamp of this family. If you leave, you take sannyas, we will all die. First, I will die. Then Vishnu Priya will die. Then all the devotees will die of broken hearts. My dear mother, you are the embodiment of love and devotion. Your love alone could soothe the hearts of the entire universe. Oh, Mother Sachi, I understand your concern, but please listen to my words. Through Maharaj became a famous devotee because he was rejected by his stepmother and father, King Atalapas. He suffered great pain and humiliation. He ran to his mother for consolation, but she told him that only Krishna could remove his miseries. That by worshipping Krishna, he would be worshipped by the three worlds. What to speak of sitting on a throne? So, by the good guidance of his mother, he attained perfection. Oh, my wonderful golden boy, I will go with you too and discuss Krishna Kata every day. You will leave my home and shave your head. I will also cut off my hair and dress in the red cloth of a renunciate. In this way, as a yogini, I will go with you. Why do you lament over meaningless miseries? In reality, who are you? Who is your son? And who is your father? Krishna's lotus feet are the only true shelter. He is the absolute Lord and the true treasure. Without Krishna, everything is useless. your affection for me and worship the lotus feet of Krishna. <coughs> The 
Feeling surprised and, sho and shocked, Sachimata stared at Garunga's face. Suddenly, Sachi Devi saw all living entities equally. At once, she realized he was Krishna. In his threefold bending form, he stood in Vrindavan surrounded by gopas and gopis and cows. Despite all this, she couldn't give up her affection for her, be for her beloved son. Oh, my dear son, you are the supremely independent Lord. It is by my, my great fortune to have raised you as my son. Now, as per your sweet will, you may go and take some else. But I have one question to ask. Why do I have to lose such a great treasure as you? My dear mother, because of your pure love for me, you will be able to see me whenever you want to. <coughs> Next day, Mahaprabhu was thinking that the time to take sannyas had come. That day, many of his associates came to visit him. Think only of Krishna, worship only Krishna, and sing only Krishna Nam. You are always in my heart, and I am always with you. That day, Vishnu Priya went to take a bath. Take the yes. This news 
life go to waste? But how, how will you go to distant countries? Your feet are softer than lotus flowers. They are so soft that even I do not touch them in fear of giving you pain. You are the personification of love. Is it me, this worthless one who is keeping you bound in material existence? That you are leaving and taking sannyas? If so, let me take one last loving glance at you before I kill myself by taking poison. Who told you that I will take sannyas? Why do you lament causelessly? <laughs> No 
Lord has the potency to be independent. Sometimes we are together, and sometimes we are separated. It is all by the will of Bhagavan. Now, I'm going to take sannyas because it is the desire of Bhagavan. Don't think that I've abandoned you. I will always see to your needs. Responsibility for your needs lies with myself and myself only. neighborhood went early in the morning to meet Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, Nimai Pandit. When they reached there, they sought, saw at once Sachi Maya was in faint. Also Vishnu Priya Devi, like dry wood, <coughs> no tears, no sense, nothing. All environment was weeping. Nimai, Nimai, where Nimai? Quickly, Sri Pandit and all others came. What happened? Why all are weeping? They began to search. But what happened in the night? Separated from her mother and wife, he came on the bank of the Ganges. So cool, very cool air was blowing. And in the midst of night, at twelve in night, he jumped up in Ganges, telling, Oh Krishna, Oh Krishna, and he jumped back. He was also not in sense. And that ghat is called Vidya ghat. 
<coughs> and anyhow, he crossed the Ganges near Kantak Nagar and he went to the ashram of Keshav Bharat. And he told that, I want to take Sanjay. He told that, it is absurd. I cannot give you Sanjay. I will not order you to shave your cut hairs. Never, never. But he was leaving Krishna, Krishna and telling that, I must take Sanjay. Anyhow, Barbar was called and he took his <laughs> But till from morning to sunrise, he could not sunshade, he could not do it. He was also weeping, Mahaprabhu was also weeping and also Kesho Bharti weeping. At that time, Chandra Shekhar Acharya and Pradadar Pandit, Anyhow, they helped, and his hair was set. Keshavati came and told, I want to give mantra, but uh, Mahaprabhu told, what mantra you are going to give me? Uh, I think that you will get give same mantra that I am telling to you. Please hear me. Same mantra or not. <laughs> and trickly he told that mantra and made him disciple. And then his Gurudev also became so happy and told, oh yes, same mantra I am going to give. And then he was given. And at once Mahaprabhu, what chant, Nimai Pandit, what chant? Oh Lord Krishna. Oh, my beloved Krishna, where you are, I cannot live without you. Sometimes I went down to the earth. And now he was going to Vrindavan. But trickly, Nityananda Prabhu took him to Shandipuri. And again Shandipuri. And there he met with her mother. And what happened? Very pathetic scene. More pathetic than the it was so pathetic. But you can imagine that what was the scene when Vishnu Priya Devi was weeping and her, his mother was weeping. He could not weep, not a drop of tear was there. But she was like oot. But for the sake of good of whole world, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu took sannyas. If he had not taken sannyas, we were not knowing him. Hare Krishna was not propagated anywhere. And what is Krishna Prem? What is Krishna? Who is Krishna? What is who is Radha? Who are gopis? Who is Vrindavan? What is Vrindavan? What is Krishna Prem? Never anyone has known. Only to sprinkle he took sannyas. And after the heart happened, you know, whole life. He was weeping and making weeping others. Very vipralambha mood. Vipralambha, you know? Separation. Taking the mood of Sri So, so many thanks to you. You have played very beautiful and very but Well, I want to. Uh, give my heartly blessings to you. That if any day you should be qualified to realize what is Krishna Prem and weep bitterly like Vishnu Priyadev and such my dear. For Krishna, oh beloved, Krishna. Though there was some lacking, so much lacking, but anyhow it was very pathetic. <laughs> <laughs> In Chaitanya Bhagavat, our Chaitanya Jatav, anywhere it is not written like this. <laughs> Vishnu Priya never requested him that I uh, knew that uh, you are going to take sannyas. Trickly, 
चैतन्य महाप्रभु